Hey guys, how you doing this morning? I've got a busy day ahead of me. Gonna get some things done today. <laughs> yeah, my goals. I'm gonna do another video on my uh, on my goals as far as an update on them. But one interesting thing that I wanted to point out was the amount of uh, bitterness, trolling, hatred that I've been getting on some of my last videos. Simply videos of me having fun, going on a hike with uh, three friends of mine. Well, it was more than a hike, it was a camping trip at Joshua Tree National Park, and it was fantastic. Uh, next time we go, we're going to take the motor home, we're going to, you know, do it right, we're going to stay a few days. Because, you know, that's the kind of thing a person really should do to have a full life, is have fun with friends, and do things like that. Of course, you got to have the money to do that, and... You know, I'm working on that, but it's interesting how my haters, all they can do is hate. All they can do is hate. Is it, why, why do they hate you? Well, the reason they hate me is because I have basically given freely without any sort of initiation fees or, you know, fees of any kind or cost or anything. I've given some information for free that they can't stand the fact that it's out there in the public domain. <laughs> because they would like to keep it hidden. They won't even use it uh, to benefit themselves, but they're going to do everything they can to make sure that nobody else has it either. So, uh, basically, what are those two things? Number one, acknowledge the authority you have in and over your own life. You are your own authority. That's reality. Number two, <laughs> treasure yourself the way a worshiper would treasure their deity. You know, and I'm going to definitely be writing a book soon, expanding on just those two points, because I think that a lot of people have problems in life because they don't love themselves nearly enough. And sometimes what we call love, we say, oh, that person loves themselves too much. No, they really don't. Uh, you don't love yourself if you're going to take part in self-indulgent activities. If you're going to, you know, become addicted to drugs or food or alcohol or sex or pie or anything else like that. The reality of it is, is people use addiction to cover up trauma, to escape trauma, to escape feeling those uncomfortable feelings instead of dealing with them. And part of having your own authority is acknowledging those feelings and working through them, which I will also talk more about in a later video. So, uh, with that said, oh, and there's a really uh, great book that's coming out soon by a, uh, a woman on YouTube known as Teal Swan. Uh, I, I think it's something to do with shadow work, how people basically, uh, you know, instead of running away from their dark side, they really need to heal that negative energy because what it is is all that darkness is it's a lack of love it's a lack of life and by working with those traumas working through the pain and the suffering you can become a better person the fact that my haters are peddlers of pain and propaganda <laughs> i mean it says more about their own character than it could ever say about mine they can call me all the names they want but the reality of it is is the fact that they have no arguments against what I've said proves that they're not worth listening to. It proves a lot more about their character or lack thereof than it ever could about my character. <laughs> Hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, feel free to subscribe, share it. Uh, love you all. Have a uh, wonderful day.